In this video, we will share and show to you about Windows 11 that support almost all system and the newer system. In here, we have modified ISO with the original ones. The original ones that we know cannot support without TPM and the secure boot. But the modified one is support for that. Let's try to install with the original ones. In here, we will select the original ones. We can click start. The modified one, you can download via the link in the description. This is the original ones. Let's try to install using VirtualBox. My system does not support for TPM and Secure Boot. So, using the original ones, I cannot install Windows 11. Let's try to click Next. Let's using scale mode in here. When we try to click, I don't have a product key. You can see here, this PC can run Windows 11. So, let's try to using the modified ICO in here. I want to shut down and change the original with the modified one. In here, when we click next and click install now, let's try to click I don't have a product key. As you can see, we can install this. You can download this ISO. We put link into the description. So, if you have old system that doesn't have TPM or Secure Boot, you can using this ISO to install Windows 11. In here, I'm using also Windows 11 that doesn't support TPM and doesn't using Secure Boot in here. And it's stable. Okay, we will pause this process to go faster. And installing features and copying files is done. We need to wait for installing update and finishing up. This installation is very easy, except uh, you are using full on your drive. 
you need to uh, be careful when make partition but if you are using empty drive you can using this uh, method is easily after like this we can just click restart now don't press any key when after booting is appear to press any key to boot from DVD or CD it means if you are press any key in there you will back to boot again and then you go to the first step to install because we already copying the files we need just to continue the installation process as you can see uh, no big problem until this step to install windows 11 with modified some files now we can continue the next step and click yes now in here let's create name of our pc and click next In here, we can click for set up for personal use. We can choose sign in options. And then let's using offline account. And in here, we can skip uh, for now. We can select don't sign in here just type for our username for example admin and for password we will skip in here we will select no for all this information this is for our privacy and click a step in here now we need to restart in here it's almost done it's 99 percent we need just wait until the process and bring us into desktop Voila, our installation is successfully and this is the Windows 11 the support for all system and the newer system. And for remember, you can download the ISO files, the link on the descriptions. Hope this video is helpful for you and thanks for watching. If any question, you can fill up in the comment forms. Thanks for watching.